What is up my Roger Bagels and welcome to some Call of Duty Modern Warfare gameplay. This is from the beta and this is kind of me giving my opinions on the beta so far. Well, for the first part of the beta anyway. So, let's get straight into it guys. So the first thing I kind of want to talk about with beta is the game itself. So, just to kind of break it down into sections, the first part we're going to talk about is kind of the play style how you have to play the game and of course the first day with no mini map and people were giving out shit about it and they finally put the mini map back in but at the start when there was no mini map it was camper fest it was claymore down at door look at the other door and just wait it out until people came and you know that's how people were getting 20, 30, 40, 50 kill gameplay. And it's really sad, like, because they'll go, like, 30 and 0 or 30 and 2 and only die twice because the Claymore wasn't there or some bullshit. I don't really know. But everybody on this game just camps. People are going to say, oh, yeah, you have to play slow, sure, you have to uh, all this. No, no, this is just full on stay in a corner, look at one door, that's it and it's really sad it makes the game really fucking shit next thing i want to talk about is the lighting in this game now there's one map where if you're going through a door and you can't once you go through the door into the hallway you actually cannot see anything and there's another doorway down the hall and you you literally can't see anything if there's a person lying on the ground you will not be able to see them for at least two seconds until the whole place lights up again and they'll have that two second uh two seconds just to be able to go and fucking shoot you or mow you down like and it's just so stupid because on the same map there's a building that one side of it is completely blown out there's like basically no wall then on the front side of it there is kind of two holes in it one big one and one kind of smallish one and then you have a apartment complex and there's actually a window where you can look out and you'll see up to that building and there's loads of gunfights always happening there however if you go into the apartment complex and go there into that window you won't actually see the person who's up in the other building because Infinity Ward being the number one Call of Duty the game developer thought it would be a brilliant idea to have sun coming through and actually can't see a player. And uh, just <coughs> bravo making a yet again a great game. God Infinity War such good fucking game developers. Jesus So the lighting in this game is pretty fucking shit The brightness and everything you could have the brightness at 50 and it's still pretty fucking dark Now I have mine up at 60 and it's still dark and I even have my monitors brightness up to 74 and it's still really fucking dark and to see players it's really really hard to also on that their names is really hard to see as well and it's it's not very well done i know it's a beta but still it's getting it's a few weeks from well september october november like december don't have you don't really have long for the game to be out and then people who are going to buy it at December as well like so you don't really have much time between then the next thing is the play style and everything like that but what I mean by that is yeah I said about people camping but there's other people that are going slide jump slide jump slide jump it's like a glitch where the player has the gun in one hand and he's doing it and the gun goes down automatically but like even without doing the animation you can shoot somebody without even looking at them and the first two bullets from your gun will in fact hit the player now uh, i 
I don't understand it. It's it's just in Modern Warfare. It's such a stupid fucking thing that's in the game. And it's more of an animation glitch, I think, because it's just really fucking shit. The next thing is mountain. Now, we had something like this in Ghosts, where everybody was like, oh, this is fucking shit and everything like that. And it was called Lean and that, where you could go up to a thing and the arrow will come up to lean and you could lean. That was shit. But mountain something just makes it even more fucking shit. Like, why is this even a thing? Yeah, fair enough to more stability and control over your accuracy and all that bullshit. But like, you just have people that'll just aim down into spawn on a head glitch, then mount. And they'll be firing away there and they'll get every shot on you because they have it mounted and it's so fucking stupid but yeah whenever i mount and shoot somebody from far away they're able to run through my fucking bullets i don't understand it i don't really understand it next thing i want to talk about is the way the connection is now i read an article where they actually have servers dedicated servers now they say dedicated servers but really and truly we all know Call of Duty will never have dedicated servers. I don't care if they even say, yes, we have dedicated servers. Look, this is the proof. Nah, nah, no, nah, you don't. No, you don't. I have been in so many games with French, German, Italian, Spanish, Portuguese, Danish people, all these fucking countries, and they're able to lag around the map and get kills. Or... I could be inside and they fucking kill me. And I'm like, how is this possible? Even on their fucking screen with their poor ass connection, you can see I clearly went through the door and my body is nowhere to be seen, but yet they still get the hitbox because their connection is shit. I'm sorry, but like, how how is that a thing? Like, this has been a thing for years the Activision and Infinity Ward, even Treyarch, won't fucking fix and it's so fucking stupid. Like, because I'm faster connected to a server doesn't mean I should be at a disadvantage. I should be at an advantage. Even in gunfights. I'll be in a gunfight and I'm shooting them. They'll start lagging and they'll fucking kill me because I'm there like, what the fuck, what the fuck? And then I'm just dead. The time to kill also in this game is extremely inconsistent it can be very quick or it can be very very slow and that's what i go back to the connection really fucking shit in this game the guns mm, i don't know quick scoping is still a thing in this game we went for a realistic game and we have no quick scoping in our game yeah for like fuck off no you don't you have it in your fucking game, you stupid fucktards. And that's back in the game. Yay, so good to have sniping virgins. Yay. The quick scope the whole time. I love it. And then the other guns, the MP5 and every and all the other assault rifles, they're decent, but with the attachments on, they're terrible. You like if my advice personally, maybe put on a holographic side, but other than that, all the other shit, the, all the other shitty attachments, underbar, optics, laser, perks, even the perks, take down stability, mobility, and control. Well, control and uh, stability, and accuracy, and range at times, and I'm there like how how is this a thing how do these make a negative impact on this weapon or on this type or on this fucking shit like i i don't understand that. how can my mobility be so fucked if i put a holographic sight on like it just it doesn't make sense to me so you know this is kind of my little video for this i know it's fairly long but that's just my 
idea of this game personally I don't like the game I really don't like the game I think the game was made by a terrible terrible developer Infinity War they have been known to make the shittest Call of Duty games Infinite Warfare Modern Warfare 2 I know loads of people are gonna say ah oh, this game's so fucking good no that game was just camping noob tubing one man army claymore bullshit and of course RPGs and they just they don't know how to make a game really they're just a bunch of amateurs really are and Modern Warfare 3 was only their good game then you have Treyarch, Black Ops 1, Black Ops 2, Black Ops 3 was fun, Black Ops 4, I don't know why loads of people hate on it, it was actually a good game, and sold very well. This game I can see it selling very well, but loads of people saying how shit it is. I've seen loads of people saying how good it is, and loads of people going like, oh well you have to adapt to the game style and all this. Like, go suck a fucking dick you fucking loser. What, you want me to go into a fucking corner just masturbate the whole time and just have a gun up and just fucking shoot somebody that comes around the corner where you have a claymore right beside you like seriously that's how i'm gonna play the game no no personally i don't like this game i think it's shit people that play it and everything are shit because they can go on 30 and 40 kill streak and they be capping or head glitching or mounting on shit and it's just fucking shit Minimap is back, I guess that's one good thing. And yeah, this is kind of the end. This is the end of the video, guys. I hope you did like it. If you did, please hit the like button. If you didn't, oh well, that's my opinion. I get my opinion. I want to hear from your opinion. Um, if you want to see next week's beta, which is going to be crossplay, and I think it's open for everyone, then go to the link in the description below. You will go to my Twitter. Follow my Twitter to stay up to date whenever I go live and whenever I upload a video. Also in the description below as well if you want to go to my Twitter where I'm usually live with the beta and I'll be live uh, soon, not like soon now today, but in the coming days with Minecraft, a new Minecraft series. Uh, I was loving Minecraft and then kind of had to leave it because we were getting a new one because everyone else was getting bored of it and I was kind of just starting off and there was no point really of just having a server for one person so we're going to split up into teams and everything like that so that will be coming up soon you can also go to my mixer which link to that will be in the description below and follow me there hit the notification button on every one of these sites and on my youtube channel if you do want to see more videos from me and stay up to date with me on my youtube channel then hit the subscribe button and hit the notification bell to know whenever i upload or i live stream on the channel but yeah that is it guys hope you like favorite and subscribe and peace